I really enjoy watching Dick Van Dyke perform, but I have to say Never a Dull Moment, although very well written, is not personally my kind of film. This is a Disney film released originally in 1968, directed by Jerry Paris, written by John Goody and A.J. Carruthers. And of course, we have Dick Van Dyke as Jack Albany. Albany is actually an actor and he is mistaken for an actual uh, hitman, a character called Ace, uh, Ace Williams. And the other people don't believe his cover. It seems like a cover that he is just this actor, Jack Albany, and they refuse to accept that he isn't Ace. And Albany has a, an interesting response to this, and he kind of goes along with it. And, and honestly, I didn't really believe his motivations. I didn't really buy into the narrative. I didn't think it was entirely believable, by which I mean the character's actions weren't believable and the situations weren't. So that's part of the reason why I didn't like it, but I also just don't care for gangster films. I don't care about films that focus on gangsters. So for me, it just wasn't really enough to sustain my attention. That being said, as I said, it is well written. There are some really good bits of dialogue. I feel like it flowed very well. Sure, I might not have believed some of the characters' actions, but it it made sense within the context of what was happening, even if I didn't completely buy into what was happening. I hope that makes sense. Dick Van Dyke was, you know, brilliant to watch and, you know, that kind of kept me going. But had it been an actor, you know, I never heard of, an actor I wasn't that bothered about, it wouldn't have been as good. Now, when watching it, I did think this is probably one of those films where I just, it's not for me, but other people love it. So I was quite surprised to see on IMDb that it's only got 6 out of 10 across 763 reviews and ratings, which is not a terrible score, but it's it's a fairly average rating. So I'm pleased that it's not, you know, one of those films everybody loves and I'm just not getting it. It's not, um, yeah, it's fine. I think if you like gangster films in general, you'll probably get more out of it than I did. I have an appreciation for some of the dialogue. Some of the dialogue's very well written. The narrative pacing is fine. In fact, it's quite good. It got to the point very quickly. Um, things uh, progress at a very steady pace. But as I said, some of the things that actually happen, I just didn't find to be that interesting, that fascinating. I really wasn't that bothered. So it's not a film for me, but I acknowledge that it might be better or it might appeal more if it is your kind of film. So never a dull moment. Well, there were definitely some dull moments, but it's not the worst film in the world, but I wouldn't be watching it again.